Well, first, I, for 27 years, I was a banker. And then uh, after that, I ended up at a nonprofit in Belle Plaine. I worked in the main office. I was kind of, a, I guess my title was Vice President of Systems and Planning. So I did planning and uh, IT and HR reported to me and kind of the backroom stuff. So I did that for the last 10 years of my career. And I retired uh, in late March of this year. So it's been seven months. I worked a lot of hours when I worked and you can't just suddenly sit there and say, okay, what's next? And what's nice about retirement is it gives you the opportunity to get much more involved in, in things you really want to do. And then you go home after your two and a half hours and all the staff members work through all the, the tough stuff and I don't have to worry about that anymore. So Where I volunteer, kind of going through my week here, uh, Open Door uh, Pantry in Egan is very important to me. I've just started there about four months ago. Uh, just by luck, just through Easter Lutheran. I really hadn't heard much about them before, but it's really kind of spoken to me for some reason. And I have, I'm there four shifts a week now, which is more than I ever thought I would be there for. I've just found that uh, I'm mostly interested in the hunger issue. So I also volunteer at the community meal, uh, three Mondays out of four. I also uh, volunteer with Fair for All at Easter Lutheran here, uh, one Tuesday a month. At Open Door, I was there earlier today, and all the thank yous and all the stories. I mean, the shoppers are with these folks for 10 or 15 minutes. I'm with them for like three or four as I take their food out to their car. But the thank yous you get, the stories you hear, people uh, today, for example, a lady just said, as I put the food in her car, in her trunk, she said, today I have choices for lunch. And I just thought, wow. And I've learned so much from those folks in those few minutes that you know I just wasn't aware of. I don't do any of this because I have to. I, I get more out of it than I give. You know, when I come home from Open Door or the community meal or whatever it is, I feel, wow, I did something that was important. So, and it's important for me to make a difference. You know, now that I'm retired. So, you know, I'm not done yet. I've only been doing this seven months. It'll turn into something else. I'll get more involved. You know, there's probably more opportunities at Open Door. Uh, I could be here four nights a week if I wanted to at the community meal. So, I, I would just say, you know. Enjoy it for two weeks or two months and say, wow, I don't have to go to work. But then you're going to want to do something that's of a higher calling, I think, however that is. And find something you like, because then you can go home after each time you've, you've served somebody and say, that was a good day. So that's what I would say. I would just say to those that are retiring soon, you don't know what it's going to be, but just be open to wherever it leads you.